this video, I'm going to show you how to edit a terrain, maybe a different way. I'm having some issues uh, clipping my terrain after it's created or deleting some extra triangles. So first let's go ahead and just create the terrain. Just using this paving with grading surface, uh, road triangles. I think what I'll do here is max triangle length at 100. And I'll just leave that RT for right now. You can see that I've got a few extra triangles. Now the issue is there's some triangles in here that I can't delete. That's kind of frustrating. Let's take a look at, at what ones those are. If I was to go ahead and remove these rules and go to edit my model, let's say I'm going to do it by triangle, you can see I can edit these triangles up here. That looks pretty good. And I can edit these. Not a problem. And I can edit these ones over here. So for some issues, I can delete these ones. Good. Not bad. Now right here, it stopped editing triangles and I have an issue right here. Um, I'm not really sure how to take care of that. There's some triangles down here I can delete. So in this example, got these triangles I can't delete. I have a terrain that eh, looks pretty good. Uh, what, what should I do next? I think I'm going to add a boundary to this. Extract that graphic. I'm going to turn my terrain off. You can see right here is that boundary. I'm just going to get my Place line and I am going to make a new boundary based off these elements here. Turn off my corridor and I'll use this break element. I'll use this intersection. Now I have this new boundary. I'm going to complex this. this boundary that I would like. You can see it kind of had that area where the triangles weren't deleting, which was kind of strange. And I'm not really sure why. Now I'm going to go back to my terrain ribbon. I'm going to create a clipped terrain. That's my original terrain. I'll give it this a new name. Locate that clipping element I made. Let's just turn that level off quick just to make sure I grab it. That guy there. I'll locate next clipping element, reset when done. I'm going to reset. 
accept the horizontal and vertical offsets here at zero. I'm going to click clip externally. Uh, you can see down here clipped terrain created. So what I will do now is here in my explore, my open roads model, terrain models. I have two trains now, this right and this uh, my BMF. That's my initials there. I'm just going to delete this terrain. I no longer need it. Now I'm just along with that, that one there. And let's see if we can clean this up, clipped terrain up. I will edit the model. I will select it. And you know, again here I can delete these triangles. Pretty good. You can see I can delete these ones. Not an issue. Let's see if I can delete these inside ones here. And the ones that I couldn't delete before, I can now delete. I don't have a reason why they did that or why they're deleting now in this clipped terrain. But this could be a workaround if you're having some issues trying to delete triangles. Uh, maybe try to create your own boundary, kind of like I did here in this video. And there you go. You know, there's some over here I have to clip out. You see, I can I can clip those no problem. It was just kind of in here that I was having some issues. So this is kind of one way. Maybe if you're having issues with, again, deleting out some triangles, try creating a boundary in just maybe the area you're having issues and kind of draw that in, create a new boundary shape, create a clip terrain from that, and seeing if you can edit that.